All right. Now we're doing free code camp, JavaScript algorithms and data structures beta. Learn basic string and array methods by building a music player. Step 43. All right. So now it's the time. Now it is time to test out the pause button. All right. So we're going to add a click event listener to the pause button element, then pass in pause song as a second argument of the event listener. This is the function that the event listener will run. And then we're going to test out the app by first clicking on the play button, followed by the pause button. And we should see that everything is working expected. All right. Uh, yeah. So this one, let's do this. Let's take this from 133 to the, uh, from the beginning of 133 to the end of this, uh, to this closing parenthesis right here, because we're going to be using that. Let's take that, drop it off. Let's change this play to pause. All right. Mm, like this. And then let's change this open parenthesis to pause button. Like that. And that should take care of it. Let's cap it off with the semicolon. Come over here. Press play. That's working. Press pause. That didn't work. That didn't work. Pause button. Pause song. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you hear it in my headphones way over there? Sony song. There we go. How about that? And pause. Okay, now it looks like it works. Uh, let's check the code. Looks good. And submit it. All right. Now we're on to step 44. And we'll see you next time.